Yo, what is going on guys? It is the SG or Command today with another Madden 21 video and today. We're going to be talking about how to get training points right now in Madden 21. In case you don't know, here on this channel, I tend to uh, cater to like the no money spent players. I give you guys some of the good under the radar methods to get uh, any type of currency in the game. Whether it be coins, training points, trophies, XP, whatever you need. It's here on the channel, so go check it out. In this video though, we're going to be talking about how to get training points. Uh, first, I'm going to give you guys all the filters you want to look through. I'm going to tell you all the, the values you can get the training for. I'm going to tell you how much you should buy the cards for. Okay. Then I'll give you my best personal preference on how I would buy the cards or what uh, filter I'd buy the cards on. And then at the end of the video, I'm going to give you guys one little coin method to get some coins to maybe buy one of these players when you're done watching the video. So uh, you can just follow along with me. And uh, we're going we're gonna to talk about some cards on the auction house right now. And uh, we're going to jump right into it. So first, we're going to talk about the 88 overalls. Okay. 88 overalls sell for 2,500 training, and in my this is in my opinion. I'm just gonna say right now, this is in my opinion the best one, if you can find it for a good price, because it's a lot of training points and it's for not that expensive, and it's that Dan Marino right there, that 62,000 coin Dan Marino. You're gonna want to buy your 88 overalls uh, for under 65,000 coins, and right there, that is a great value. Um, I believe that will be the cheapest one on auction house right now as well. Uh, I actually kind of checked through the filters before I made this video, so I knew that would be there. So, uh, yeah, buy your 88 overalls for under 65,000 coins. And in my opinion, this is the best filter in the game. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys have that with you today. All right, so now we're going to talk about 87 overalls because 87s are still good value. I'll be honest. They are good value. Um, here you can kind of focus on two filters. I've been looking at halfbacks. Um, halfbacks are decent, I guess. So look at over here. Maybe we can filter by Core Elite. Uh, there's, there's a couple different filters though when you go by program. Um, like Derek Henry is obviously the too expensive uh, in 50,000 coins. So I would not go for that one. You're going to want to buy these for about 45,000 coins or less. Okay, there was one earlier. It was actually a tire locket if we go by team of the week. Right over here. Team of the week. There's a tire locket. Okay, see that's too expensive now. There's one earlier for 42,000 coins. So buy your 87 overalls for under 45,000 coins that way you can get good value 87 overall is quick sell for 1,800 training so there you go there's your second filter for today and in my opinion the second best filter as well so uh, now we're going to talk about 85 or 84 and 85 overalls in my opinion you can't really go wrong with either one uh, just because they're such low overalls you're not spending very many coins on them and it's a very safe investment whether you're powering someone up or whatever you won't have anything left over really so uh, like I said, it's a really safe purchase to go with. So um, here we go. We're going to actually filter by Legends because Legends can sometimes be the cheapest. For this one, though, I w like, you know, if you're only going to save like a thousand coins by doing this, by really getting really specific filters, okay? For for uh, the 84s, I would filter by Core Elites. Uh, the 84 overall is quick sell for uh, 640 training. I would buy these for like under 19,000 coins. Either way though, I mean if you're going to buy it for 20,000, it's really not that big of a difference because it's such a low overall. The the uh, the gap in between cards will be so small, maybe 1,000 to 2,000 coins. So just buy these for around 19,000 coins. The 85 overalls though, I, w I was noticing like a week ago, the best ones to buy the 85 overalls were actually in the Legends. And if you filter by right end, it was the Richard Seymour's. Those were good ones. Oh, I'm sorry, he's 84. What am I thinking? Uh, who was it? Was it Deion Sanders? No, it was, yeah, it was Deion Sanders, I think, actually. Deion Sanders. Right when he came out, I noticed. Yeah. Uh, I believe he has 85, right? Yeah, he's 85 right there. 29,000 coins. That's not terrible value. Um, I would buy these for about 27, 26,000 coins. These actually sell. They quick sell for 900 training. So um, here we go. That's pretty much it for the for the filters. I would rank the first one the best, the second one the second best, and the one I just showed you uh, the third best. So there you go. Uh, honestly, just whatever one is best for you, though, go with that one. If you don't want to spend that many coins, maybe go with the second or third method. But if you're fine with spending 60,000 coins on training, I would definitely do the first one that I showed you guys. So now um, we're going to talk about how to get a little bit of coins, maybe, to hopefully buy one of these players for you guys. One of the things I have been doing, uh, I'll talk about this in a video, I think, tomorrow or the next day. Actually, it will be tomorrow when I get my weekend league rewards, okay? Uh, well, I'll get them today, but I'll, I'll actually upload the video tomorrow. Um, I've been doing this 50 exchange set, 
and you can sell these cards for like 20,000 coins and you can do these sets for like 15,000 coins or less and it doesn't it only takes like three minutes what you do is you just put uh, I think it's eight yeah it's eight 75 to 79 overall cards put them into a set and then you get an 81 overall card and these cards well uh, they sell for about uh, 20,000 coins on the market so if you can spend uh, 15,000 coins on these and then quick sell them on the market not quick sell them, but if you can sell them on the market for about 20,000 It's very good value. I already made a video about this on the channel So I think it was like my last coin making video. So if you guys want to go check that out go right ahead But uh, that is gonna do it for this tutorial uh, We're gonna do shout outs right now in case you don't know I do shout outs on every single video uh, If you want to get shouted out comment on this video, I'll shout you out in my next video I uh, want to give a shout out to uh, Jonte dubs. I'm pretty sure I've seen you before here on the channel. So thank you for commenting on the last video and uh, I think I think we had a couple more. I want to say Jared Matthews. I think that was the other one. So I uh, hope you guys are great yesterday. Stay safe for me and peace out. <laughs>